So in this video it's going to be about an old Sony Walkman. It's going to be this one here. And uh, I absolutely used to love this uh, little device. But things have moved on. But I actually found it the other day. Um, but I couldn't... F and, and I thought it was uh, I thought it was broken. But I've actually managed to fix it. But I couldn't find anything on it. So for example this is no photos. And it says no photos to display. And the same with music, no files or MP3s to play. And once again, there's no videos on this at all either. So like I do with everything like that, where it seems as though it's clean, I always, uh, and I've mentioned quite a few times with the, some of the software I use. And uh, so that's what I'm going to do is try to see if there's actually any files on this by re trying to use recovery X data and just pop this in USB and see how that works. PC 3.72 gigabytes free of 3.73. So that's um, that is just one or two files. Uh, yeah, so just one file actually. So recovery X data and what we're going to do here is I've used this um, previously on a few videos and I've, I think it's a, it's an excellent program. Recovery from, so there's the Walkman there. So it's just blue dot. Didn't find it, one deep recover. So now we're going to do this for a deep recover in this Walkman. So this is going to take uh, quite a long time. It's three point seven two is not a massive, uh, massive gigabytes on, but it still takes a little while to get through. So I'll come back when I've when it's all done and see what we'll find if anything at all. If we just have a look and see what we found. So this uh, this is all finished now. So you've found how many? You found 1,613 files over 3.26 gigabytes. Wow, dear me. And we started off with nothing. Um, I didn't actually think there was anything on this from, from memory at all. And, and there wasn't um, when we looked at it. But of course, it's uh, it, it hasn't been uh, totally destroyed or anything, the data. So we'll cover this. And what we want to do now is we're going to recover it in the uh, a different, you know, you kind of just put it into the same place as where your Walkman is. So you kind of, you know, that's, uh, I think I've explained that before on, on here as well about these things. So what we're doing is we're going to an external SD card, which is already in the, uh, um, the computer. And we're just going to put it into Sony Walkman. So that's where the files will be stored. So we just put that needs 3.26 gigabytes. Got plenty of space there. So we just let that run for a little while. Not sure how long that will uh, take, but it says data recovery finished 8%. It does take a long time this. Yeah, I think that took about three quarters of an hour or something like that. And that's just over four gigabytes. So there, uh, well, it's about 3.73 gigabytes on a 4 gigabyte drive. Um, error on exporting there. The, uh, well, it's an external um, SD, but I'll put it actually in the computer. So we have here, um, oh, loads and loads of files, as you can see. Um, and unknown path folder and audio so look at all them there's, uh, there's going to be quite a few there I would imagine I'll just go back on that properties and we've got 1.46 gigabytes and 1.52 on the drive um, so yeah so that's a, that's a huge amount of mp3s and I used to use this extensively. Um, files. That's not much that one. I don't know what that is. Pictures. Now that's 35.7 gigabyte. Um, 30, 
35.7 megabytes. Videos 6.3, so it might only be one or two on that. Let's have a look at two, yeah. Not really bothered about the error on recovery. It actually does raw files as well, there, so and not just JPEGs. Um, how many pictures have we got on here? Um, so we just do properties. Not much, 35.7 megabytes, so not not a lot at all. So the basically what the um, the gist of the video is um, is I'm going to do a, a data um, data retrieval, a data forensics on um, another channel, maybe, and transfer some of these videos that I do about it on onto there. Um, I think the important they, were, they are very important. This is like life savers, really, uh, data wise. There's so many things that you lose, we all do, and uh, we always think, oh, I wish I kept that photograph, or I wish I kept that album, or, you know, like sort of in music again, wish I kept an album or something, you know. And, uh, and when you go back up, it really is good, because uh, you can just go to it, and it's it's not, uh, if it's overwritten, unfortunately, there's nothing you can do about that. So as soon as you know that there's something that you want back, really, Get something like this, Recovery X Data Pro. I'm not affiliated in any way, but I think it's, for me, it's a step down from the forensics uh, type of thing. And it's very simple interface. There's nothing difficult really about it. And uh, yeah, so again, um, thank you for watching.